Let's give a simple example of what front running looks like on a publicly visible blockchain such as Ethereum, where the mempool of potential transactions are unencrypted. To properly illustrate this example, we will be using an extremely illiquid and thin order book. Meet Bob. He is a Uniswap user that wants to purchase 5 ETH from the order book. Bob submits a market buy for 5 ETH using 10 GUI as the gas price. Note that Bob's purchase will not be made until a block producer includes his transaction. Now we introduce our front runner into the equation. The front runner is constantly parsing through the publicly visible mempool for opportunities to arbitrage. The front runner realizes that with the current order book and with Bob's soon to be executed transaction, there is an opportunity for riskless profit at the cost of Bob. Here is how. The runner submits a market buy of 5F, same as Bob, but using a higher gas price. When he does this, he will be serviced first. This transaction with the higher gas price is serviced first. Next, the runner submits a sell that will occur after the market buy of the front runner. Important to note, this sell transaction will occur before Bob's 5F purchase. Now let's complete the transactions in the order of submitted gas price. First, the runner purchases the first 5F available on the order books. Next, the front runner has their second transaction executed for 19 GUI. This posts a sell of 5F at $1.02 on the order book. Finally, Bob's transaction using 10 GUI is finally on deck for his 5F purchase to execute. Unfortunately for him, the only available F for purchase are the 5F posted by the front runner for $1.02 instead of the $1 sell price Bob had originally seen on the order books. Bob ends up with 5 th purchased, but unfortunately for him, he got front run. What is the end result? Bob wanted to purchase 5 th for a dollar, but he ended up having to spend a dollar and two cents. The front runner, on the other hand, made pure arbitrage profit, zero risk involved. Front running damages users and buyers. Bots can constantly parse through the mempool of potential transactions, outbid transactions using a higher gas fee, and then ultimately elicit a profit at the cost of the party unaware of the activity of the front runner. Front running is a massive problem. If you are an institution or a user wanting to use a decentralized exchange, how do you go about purchasing hundreds and thousands of Ethereum or wrapped Bitcoin without getting front run? The answer is Secret Network, a privacy preserving protocol that allows for tools such as the Secret Automated Market Maker. On this decentralized exchange, the mempool is fully encrypted while the order book stays publicly visible. Now, if a front runner wants to try to leverage this system, if they, if they want to try to break secret network in terms of front running, it immediately becomes very difficult. Here's why. When Bob submits a transaction for a market buy of 5F, there is a key and distinct difference from the previous example. If a front runner tries to parse through and check the mempool to scan for arbitrage opportunities, they will be sorely disappointed because the entire mempool is encrypted. You can't front run an exchange attached to a protocol where such data is encrypted using secret contracts and an entire network of trusted execution environments hosted on a range of distributed nodes. Finally, Bob's transaction executes. And he is now the proud owner of 5S without ever getting front run. If you are interested in learning how trusted execution environments and the secret network protocol works, you can read the gray paper linked below. Secret network is the future of DeFi. Front running is solved by default. Fees are cheaper. Transactions execute quicker and privacy is fully programmable. 
Welcome to Seeker Network, the future of privacy, DeFi, and Web 3.0.